Assalamualaikum and hello to Dr. Mashita bin Abdul Jabbar and my famous friend. My name is Farisa Atira binti Sarija and with my partner Shafika binti Razali, we will be presenting our assignment. For this assignment, we choose Rawa Islands as our topic. According to Rawa Island Resort website, Rawa Island is one of small island in Mersen District, Johor, Malaysia. It is located about 60 km offshore of Johor. Visitor can Visitor who want go to Rawa Island should park their car in the secure car parking facility and pay around 15 ringgit for one day and take around 20 minutes pivot service for Mersing JT before reach the island. Rawa Island which is owned by the Sultan of Johor family and have two resorts uh, that provide accommodation facility for visitor which are Rawa Island Resort and the smaller one uh, Alang Rawa. For this slide I will explain why I choose this place for uh, our assignment because first point is crystal clear water. Uh, Rawa Island also knows, known as the Malaysian Maldives Island because the tourists from island think so. Rawa Island have turquoise blue sea water that is so clear and clean that it can melt the seabed from the upper surface. Tourists can see marine life such as coral, finch and turtle. Next point is world class driver's side. According to Extreme Magazine, there is only one drive operation, operator on the island which is Orca Scuba. Orca Scuba not as Orca Nation, Asia lead five-star instructor development center. It also have party certificate drive course for children uh, start from eight years old and fun driving option on Pulau Rawa. The operator main focus to introduce families and children for the world of scuba driving and to provide the highest level of professionalism and safety possible. Next, there are rooms to suit all tastes. According to Rawa, Pulau Rawa Resort website, all rooms are equipped with an suite bathroom, hot water, fresh water shower, and air conditioning. Pulau Rawa Resort has a four types of comfortable accommodation, suitable for all types of customer group. There is a hillside deluxe which enjoy the lush green surrounding of you. Next, beach view or beachfront chalet with a view of sand and sea. Next, waterfront bungalow independent chalet offer an interrupt view of the South China Sea. Finally, Frangipani Villa will afford guests more privacy. <clears throat> Last point is natural beauty and stunning landscape. According to escape from the little red dot block, to see the sunrise, visitors need to climb the hill to get to the other part of island. The Rawa Island area also has cactus plant as large as 30, 30 meters and have various types of size. Near the cactus tree area, there is also an old habitat with a bo box house of the tree. There are four types of potential tourist products in Rawa Island. First is activity. According to Rawa Island website, Rawa Island has a variety of sea sport activity of for tourists to do such as snorkeling, kayaking and scuba diving. Tourists also have the opportunity to see the beauty of island around the uh, around with island hopping activity. Guests can also enjoy a walk or climb to the top of island where they will be rewarded with a panoramic view of the surrounding island and the South China Sea. Next point is marine life. According to Extreme Max magazine, the marine life around the island is very variant. Around the jetty, they have house of reef. When you dive, you will find huge school of bad fish, saltwater perch, and silver side. Also stonefish. The noodle bridge lover, Rawa Island has various species of noodle bridge. Next point is spa. S spa service. Against a backdrop of standing view overlooking the salt South China Sea, Rawa Spa offer a range of body, face and foot massage to suit the needs of couple and family alike. All treatment use only the sorry, all treatment use only the fresh local ingredient. Last point is food and beverage. Pulau Rawa serve a variety of international and local dishes with a menu the various day by day. Food is provided as a buffet three times a day and not forgetting that on Saturday night, the resort will make a barbecue. Next, the customer policy part. I will begin with collect customer information. The company hold, hold a promise to comply with the Personal Data Protection Act 2010. Customer can access the official website without entering any data, except when they try to subscribe to any product provide. The resort will store personal information for future purpose. Next point is bring alcoholic beverage. 
Pulau Rawa take great care when customers went to bring outside food and drink to the island. They have imposed a free policy to drink such as beer, 10 ringgit per can, wine, 70 ringgit per bottle, champagne, campaign, uh, 90 ringgit per bottle, soft drink, 10 ringgit per can, and liquid 100 ringgit per bottle. Next point about the tourism policy, which is uh, do not do extreme spot water. Based on Pulau Rawa, is uh, an island in Malaysia that offers a variety of water sports and activities for visitors. However, there are some restrictions on extreme water sports such as jet ski because it wants to protect the coral reef and marine life. While jet ski is not available in Pulau Rawa, still, but they still provide a range of water-based activity for visitors to enjoy. The island is accessible from Singapore and the resort offers a variety of packages and activities for the guests. The last point in a tourism policy which is a private island area. The quiet beach on a Rawa island is well known for providing solace to families that come to spend time there. The carefully, that, the carefully tends to this island to ensure that visitors are as secure from the irresponsible action of outsiders and that the island remains peacefully. When they have uh, completed their island hopping, they are also not allowed to re-enter the Rawa island. They use these precautions to ensure visitor safety and prevent people who do not visit or register on Rawa island from destroying marine life such as coral reef. So, my name is Shafika Bindi Razali and my card metric is 2022753257. So, I will continue the presentation with the next item, which is the critics and the comments of the tourists who have visited the Rawa Island. The Rawa Island have uh, two sides, which is a uh, good and a bad. The first advantage is, the, is that it is uh, suitable for the family. It is said that tourists believe the location is a pirate for largest families. It can also enjoy a tranquil atmosphere because the neighboring island have a diverse population. Because its location is private and picture, picturesque, this, is, this island is ideal for families that want to separate family stay. The factor in the good side is the affordable price in the terms of the food, longage, and the pleasure of the beach atmosphere with their price are quite low in the term of buffet, which is a start at 9 Malaysian ringgits. But the consent is worth the money. Guests appreciate the resort's comfort since they can see the beauty of the Rawa Island via the, door, via the window in their accommodation. As a result, their costs are re relatively low because the location is gorgeous, the food is good, and the resort caters the traveler's preference. Next, on the list of a bad site is the lack of facilities infrastructure on the Rawa Island. Some visitors were extremely disappointed by the absence of the amenities like a TV, fee, and extra towel in each room. The customer was also less delighted with the Rawa Island as a result of having to carry hot water to the lobby which was 5 minutes away from his accommodations. The second issue which is the, that the weather makes it difficult to properly postpone tourism related activities. Accidents will occur with tourists continue in inclement weather, so the owner of the marshy island takes the most suitable time to dive on the island are March through November. Between November and February, the north heads the northeast monsoon kits in making the diver condition less than desirable with poor visibility, strong current and a large wave. Next slide I will talk about the design standard in Rawa Island. The first design standard in our Rawa Island is the environment conservation which is uh, its effort on the island Rawa in the Johor are evident through various in initiatives and projects aimed at the protecting the island's natural beauty and marine environment. Pulau Rawa is located with the Sultan Iskandar Marine Park, a conservation area under the protection of the Malaysian Department of Marine Parks. The Marine Park fee is a charge to divert to help fund the protection of the Marine Park. The effort of the conserve the marine environment also included the conservation of dugong habits in the water of Mersing, which is encompassed Pulau Rawa. Next design standard, which is a sustainability infra infrastructure, which is a Rawa Island Resort, has committed to sustainability by working with local and international university related to flora and fauna, is the island. Using natural and recycled construction materials, operating a strict waste collection and recycling policy, and collecting rainwater for watering plants. The resort has also introduced the barn hole on Rawa Island as a means of biological control of rats in conjunction with the School of Biological Science University, Science Malaysia, and collaborate with ORCA, SCUBA, and the Department of Geography, University Malaya on a coral nursery project. 
This effort demonstrates the island's commitment to environment uh, conversation and the need for continued collaboration among stakeholders to protect and preserve the natural beauty of our island. The last of the design standard, which is a low impact infrastructure. The impact of low infrastructure on Rawa Island can be seen in various aspects, including tourism, environment, and community prosperity. The lack of proper infrastructure, such as a transportation, energy, supply, and a healthy grass facility, has led to limited development activities and low community, community pros prosperity. Additionally, the in Inadequate management service increased population and the absence of the institutional facility like hospital and, ATV and ATMs have affected the tourist experience on the island. Furthermore, the growth of the, growth of the tourism has brought, brought both positive and negative impact on the environment of small islands like Rawa Island. These factors collectively highlight the significant influence of low infrastructure on the island's environment, economy, and overall vis uh, visitor experience. If the management upgrades their service and the facilities, it could it could attract more tourists to pull out to Rawa Island. So the next slide is about the conclusion of Rawa Island. In conclusion, Rawa Islands offer a convent and a future quest gateway with its abilities, nature, beauty, and the range of the activities. Despite some concerns raised by the visitors, the island's unique charm and the and peaceful environment make it a worthwhile destination for those seeking a memor memorable beach vacations.